But he's loving it though. <gasps> Look at his, oh my god, his, his little happy face. Oh, I love George's little happy face. It's like when his eyes squint and he kind of smiles with his very grumpy expression. Hey YouTube, how's it going? My name is Lucas and welcome back to the 100 Baby Challenge. Look at these two, our brand new additions we had in the last part. Um, what was the name again? Tabitha, that was it. Tabitha and Brock Alto. She looks really cute but also kind of uncomfortable at the same time. Um, cuties, can I just say? Adorable, utterly adorable. <gasps> oh my god, that was so cute. Sorry, gotta turn the game volume down to it, it's so loud. Um, Right, what are we doing today? Today we are going to be working on their skills to get them into kids, hopefully. So here's where they're standing right now. Uh, they're doing pretty well. We've had like the whole of Saturday, which was yesterday in game, to like work on them. So they're all doing pretty well. Right, you've got to get your communication up. So keep on babbling to your brother. Work on that skill. It's new skill day as well. Um, so let's, let's, I guess... See if we can find a skill for Junko to do. Right, Junko, what can you do? Uh, what school level is she at as well? She's B. Okay, so I'd say we're kind of getting towards the end of Junko's time here. So let's try and make the most of it. Who? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Who are you? Cyrus. Oh, no, he's a Stan. Cyrus. I was going to sleep with him as well. Is that Sword Girl's um husband? Cyrus, what is he doing? S Mini, stop him! Stop him! Stop him! Ha! Huh. Mm. Oh, just go away. Well, at least he's putting it back. Also, he's old. Mr. Sword Girl got very old. Um, anyway, what was I doing? Oh, yeah, finding a skill for Junko to do. What has she done? Um, she could maybe do some painting, I guess. We have this graffiti thing we've never used before because I don't know how to use it. We've got to stock the table. So does does that mean we've got to buy something online? Like, have we got to buy paint online, maybe? If so, she could maybe be our first graffiti artist. Order... Mm, nothing to do with graffiti that I could see. Do we buy them in build and buy mode? I've never seen any... I don't know, I genuinely have no clue. Um, She's been working on her vampire skill. So, where is it? Uh, there we go. So, she's sort of like level 1-ish still. Um, a fledgling vampire. But yeah, now she could become a bat, which is always welcome. Uh, how... How does she... Can, she, can we make her do that? Can we make her become a bat? <gasps> we can! Always move as a bat. Oh... Oh, Junko. Is she not going to become a bat? So, if we fly... <gasps> Go on, go do it. Go do it, Junko, go do it. Yeah, there was a severe lack of becoming a bat just then. Was it too... Why are you not becoming a bat? Fly here as a bat. Maybe it was just too close. Oh my god, what a legend. What a legend. Right, what skill? What skill? Um, Gardening. Ooh. Oh, we have no seeds. Also, you'll be leaving soon and I don't want need to keep doing that guard. Can you cook? She can't. Okay, go make something. Clean out the spoiled food. And then... Serve us all some franken beans. Don't burn down the house. I'm trusting you. Uh, Minnie, can you maybe help your kids? Oh! Someone's made a mess. Who's made a mess? Clean that up. Brick. No, you're Brock, sorry. His dad is called Brick. You're Brock. You gotta get your movement up. And your thinking. Bob to the music. And then... He can't do shapes. Oh. Where are you? Go Bob to music! Come on! Why? Why? What's what's the problem? What's the problem? Why can't you Bob to music? Come on, you could do this, Brick. I've seen you do it before. Brock, sorry, you're Brock. Brock and Tabitha. Come on, why is he not doing- Why? I've seen them do it before. What is the issue? What genuinely? What is the issue? I'm, I've I've swear I've seen them do this before. Okay, Minnie, can you help him out with something? Can we dance with him? She'll probably have some difficulty as well. Right, uh, Tabitha, you go and work on your thinking. 
Oh, look at these two. Come on. Please tell me she could do it with him. No, why? What? What is going on? Maybe because we've since brought maybe the chairs closer. There's not enough space. I don't know. Either way, we've got to get him to move about. Just keep moving about then, I guess. How else do we get moving up? Oh, these. You can stack these. I'll buy another set. Also, we've got to clean out the potty as well. Yuck. Um, Block. There you go, Brock. That rhymed. Yeah, go go stack some of these bad boys. Uh, mini. What should we have Mini do? Learn, can she learn a new skill? Maybe she already has. I think she already has. Um, try out a new skill or develop an existing one. What can we have her do? Do you want to... Um, do you want to maybe craft something? Craft a knife block in case... What's his face comes back. Cyrus Star keeps rummaging through our trash. Because that, that was just disgusting. Uh, Junko, where are you at? Oh, she's helping her siblings. We stand. Right. Have you done your homework? She's done her homework. Alex wants to... Yeah, we can go over to Alex's house. I mean, I don't want to go with Junko. I want to stay with Minnie. But, um... I guess we'll have to go with her and then pop back to Minnie. I don't know. I don't want to go to the Slade's house, personally. They've got that tiny cramped apartment with their dad. I think... This dad has kids, so there's going to be like five of them. Not fun. Not fun. Uh, yeah, how are they all surviving in here? I don't know. Oh my god, that child is so pale. Ugh! No, 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 no. It's like Brad all over again. No, no. Oh, there's a second one. Are you pale? Yes, you are. We're getting away. We're getting away. Um. Right, what did we do in the last episode? I'm trying to think. Last episode. Oh, we had a little family gathering. That was it. We went to the Goths, saw our grandkids, played with them. We had, obviously, the kids. They were all very cute. It was a very nice episode. I quite liked that episode. You know, we had some, some callbacks. We saw Mini Junior as an elder. Still creeps me out. Gave her a potion of youth, but I haven't, like, had her drink it yet. So she's still going to be very old. Mini, can you please go help your kids? Come on, we've got to get them, like, aged up today. Yo, keep stacking those. What are you doing? She's babbling to herself. That's good. Why don't you go um, babble to Blarfy? And then... That's the only skill left. And thinking as well. Okay, babble to Blarfy. And then start shapes. I just have Minnie help them probably. Because I'll speed it up, won't I? If Minnie helps them, that increases their skill. Um, thingy-majig. Nice, nice English there. Their skill thingy, Majig. Sorry, sorry. I'm just so you could tell. I'm just I'm so tired today as I'm doing this. Ah, uh, not fun. Well, it is fun, but it's just sometimes you're just like not in the mood to talk. You know, if any of my fellow sim YouTubers out there, sometimes you just feel like playing the game, and it's like, oh, I got to talk as well. I got to provide some kind of insight, some kind of like, uh, you know, intelligent conversation. Which I'm clearly not doing now. Oh, George. Oh, come on. Can we... We need to appreciate George. We haven't appreciated George in a while. Give him a kiss. I've been having Junko, like, get closer with him. Because Junko is an animal lover. And that's part of, like, her aspirations. So I thought, you know, I'll have... I'll have Junko, like, kind of befriend George a little bit. Oh, I love him so much. I love he's got, like, a very grumpy face. But he's just a little cinnamon roll, really. Like, you can see how he's loving the affection. Can we get, like, a cute close-up on this? Oh... We stand. When George dies, I'm probably going to cry. Like, no joke. I probably will cry. Uh, oh, I've updated this, if you can't tell. I've put Junko on there. I've changed the lighting. So I noticed, obviously, the pictures down below are very, very dark. And I thought, um, I first thought it was a picture of the, like, a problem with the pictures. Then I realised that it could just be because the lighting was closer up here. So I've put in some down below. Uh, so all the lighting seems a bit better now. Connor's here. Of course Connor's here. Connor, why are you always here? I need to take it. The, I need to take the key back off him because he's always here. He's always here. He, Connor, why? I love you, but why? Why do you always come to our house? Why? Why, 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 why? Can we give him a hug? He clearly is going through something. Let's give him a hug. Um, Come on, you got to hurry this up, Brock. We've got to finish this today. Maybe I'll have her go down and like work on the skills with him, I guess. Okay, your thinking is up. You can stop doing that now. Keep talking to Blarfy. Just keep on babbling. Keep babbling. Keep babbling. 
Minnie, can you get over here and like help him with his uh is this, which skill is this the movement skill he's doing? I think it's the movement skill. No, it's his thinking skill. Oh, right. Um I'm so confused. Yes, yeah, his thinking skill. Sorry, I'm I'm stupid. Go help him with his thinking. Go leave Connor. Ruben, what? What do you want, Ruben? We'd love to have you <laughs> Hey Minnie, we'd love to have you join the We Are Better Than You. That's the little click. Oh, no thanks, because he... that's a very mean click. They, they go around bullying people, and I'm just not having many bully people. Help him. How do we How do we level up the um in, uh, the thinking skill? Is it no book? It's cards, isn't it? It's flashcards. Also, how are their needs looking? The needs are all doing fine. Having a whale of a time. Mini... We get Junko back here. I don't. Uh, yeah, come on, Junko. You're sure you're doing nothing productive over at the Slade's house. Keep doing your vampire lore, I guess. Uh, can she read the next level up? She can. Yeah. Keep doing that, bad boy. I said that very strangely. Then <laughs> keep doing that, bad boy. Uh, you know, might as well do something productive. If not, she can maybe go help with the kids, because God knows the kids need it. Actually, you could you could also clean this out once you're done, because that's getting a little bit stinky. Oh, also, what is her trimester? Because we had a baby with Orange. Was it his name? Orange? Orange, um... Orange Bailey Moon. That was it. Uh, where, where, where is it? First trimester. Okay, so it's going to be a while since we give birth to whatever weird baby we have with Orange. I, I want... I, to be honest, I kind of want twins just to give them really weird colour names. I think it'll be so... If it's a girl, it's going to be Violet. Like, 100% going to be Violet, Bailey Moon. Um, oh, what if it's a boy? Maybe Blue, but, like, spell it with two O's. Like, Blue, that's kind of cool and edgy. Blue, Bailey Moon, that's a cool name. Right, yeah. Uh, where did the girl go? The girl, sorry, that was very dehumanising. What are you doing? What are you... Where are you going? Whoa, 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 you better... You leave... Oh, please... Oh, she's going to have a cute moment with George. Go on, go go have a cute moment with George. Oh my god, the the level of cuteness. I am. Le oh my. Do Whoa, are you scared? You better kick him then for a second. Whoa, Tabitha, you do not kick George in this house. But he's loving it though. <gasps> Look at his. Oh my god, his, his little happy face. Oh, I love George's little happy face. It's like when his eyes squint and he kind of smiles with very grumpy expression. <gasps> go pet him. Go on, Tabitha. Be brave. Give him a pet. Give him a cute little pet. Sorry, I just this is so cute. Oh, be, be gentle, be gentle. Oh no, did he not like that? No, I think he liked that. Oh, see, when I had a cat, I hated toddlers around them, like or any kids, because they do not know how to be gentle. And like a couple times, a kid would come over, be like, "Ooh, kitty," and just proceed to like slap the ever living daylights out of her. I'm um, obviously not too hard because it's a toddler, but you know, clearly the cat wasn't enjoying it. Thankfully, my cat was declawed. Oh, that's a horrible sentence. Not by me. I'll go clarify this. We got her declawed. We did not declaw her. Declawing her is unethical. When I say thankfully she's declawed, I don't mean to say declawing is a good thing. Oh my god, I put myself in a hole here. But you know what I'm saying? Like, she didn't have claws, so like she couldn't attack the child or anything. Um, but yeah, declawing a cat, no go. Uh, but... I would always get anxiety when, like, a toddler was around my cat. I was like, Mum, you do realise, like, she's going to try and pull the tail or something. Be like, oh, yeah, I'm petting it, and the cat's not going to like it, and she may not have claws, but she can bite, and just, oh, I did Sorry. My cat was terrified of, like, the toddler, I'd say. But, yeah, do not declaw cats. Bad thing to do. We got her declawed again, just to clarify. We did not do it ourselves. Not a nice thing to do. Uh, oh, George. Precious George. Precious little George. Right. Where, where, how are the kids doing? How is, how is little what's-his-face doing? Oh, they're all at three. That was very quick. Oh, I guess Minnie, like, properly sped that up. Right, Minnie, go bake us a cake. Gotta get some traits as well. Thanks for hanging out with me. We had no choice, Connor. We had no choice. You came into our house. Sorry. Love me some Connor, but Jesus Christ, he's got some serious attachment issues. 
always coming around to our house. I know his mum in game kind of died recently, so maybe he's trying to fill the void with Minnie. I don't know. But it's, I, I have no clue, to be honest. Maybe he just likes seeing his sort of, um, his... I would say his nieces and nephews, but they're not his nieces and nephew. I'm trying to think. No, they technically they're his like they're like his cousin-in-law because they. No, hold on, they're Spooks' siblings. So what is that? They're like Spook. They're like Connor's siblings-in-law, right? I guess so. I guess that's what I'm getting at. Yeah, that would be it, right? If they're Spooks' sibling, like then they'd be like Connor's sister or brother-in-law. In which case, my theory about him seeing his his nephews does not work. In the slightest. Uh, come on, let's get that cake ready. I'll get the traits ready. Um, I said that as if, like, someone else would get the traits ready. Like, I'll get the traits ready. Like, I don't know. Are you guys gonna get the traits ready? Don't put it on the floor, Mini! Sorry, I said that very aggressively. Don't put it on the floor, Mini! Yeah, you go pee. Um, you go pee. We'll have Junko put on some candles. Add me some birthday candles. We'll do... Who was first? Tabitha was first, right? Siri, give me a random number between 1 and 40. That would be 16. 16. I'm still not used to her just batting about, like, zoom. 16. Okay, go give uh, Tabitha some help. Tabitha, Alto. 16. What is 16? I have no clue. We'll find out together. Please don't be something horrible. I really like Tabitha. She's so cute. I, last thing I want is like a evil Tabitha or like a mean-spirited Tabitha. Why? Who keeps making a mess? I think it's Brock. I, I had to tell him off off camera because he just he was making a mess before and Minnie was like, no, stop that. Where are you going? Whoa, 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 whoa. No, you're supposed to help blow out candles. That is in the centre, right? It's got to be in the centre. Tabitha Alto, come on. Chop, chop. We don't have all day. It's getting late. You have school tomorrow. We're on it. We're... Oh, I... what? what is happening? Okay, Minnie's doing it. Thankfully, thank thank you, sorry. We have someone responsible. She Did she do it? She did it. Oh my god, yes. What is she going to be? 16, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8... 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Dog love it. Yes, that is a cute one. Sorry, we love it. So maybe I'll go for like social. Social butterfly. She looks a bit boyish. That's fine. That's fine. What is that? Tradition complete. Oh, good on you. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Mini, 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 mini. It's not over yet. Only halfway there. Where is he? Oh, he's having a little bit of a sleep. Yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll go do him next. Uh, help blow out candles for our good friend Brock. Meanwhile, we'll have, we'll go have Tabitha, like, change her appearance afterwards. We'll maybe do a bit of, like, creator simming on them. Is that a verb, creator simming? I don't know. I made it a verb, so. What I say goes, it's my channel, deal with it. Mini Junior sent Tabitha a gift. Oh, cute. Very cute. Bradislaus, what is he wearing? He's got a fedora on. Oh, God. He couldn't get any weirder. Ruby sent her a gift. Spooks sent her a gift. And now she's famous. Oh, great. Brock is aged up. Oh, trait for Brock. Give me a random number between one... I didn't catch that. You interrupted me. Give me a random number between one and 40. It's 23. 23. Okay, so if Dog Lover was 16... Uh, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, erratic. Oh, Jesus. I guess we'll have to go for, like, creativity. Because usually, you know, creative people are a little bit um, wild, shall we say. That's the politically correct term. Yes, Brock, my friend. Go plan your appearance. We'll go see how they look in Creator Sim. Um, they look really cute from, like, down here. They look adorable. You could tell they're twins. They are, like, very similar if we just go back and forth. Tabitha's got obviously a bit more like bigger feminine eyes, but aside from that, I can't see any. They got the same mouth, the same nose. Oh, that is spooky! That is so spooky. I mean, I say I say it's spooky as if they're not siblings and twins. It's not really that spooky to be honest. Um. Also, Junko, can you please tidy that up? I know it's not your mess, but you have got to set a good example as the older sister. Right. Okay. 
How are they looking? Create a sim. Also, I haven't done her dark form either. I'll go do that at some point. Oh, she is cute. She's adorable. I really love the short hair on her, but as well, I want to give her some long hair. Do I have Do I have that CC toddler hair that she had? I do, yes. <gasps> princess. Actual princess. Oh my god, she's so adorable. You just want to give her, like, so many hugs. You want to give her, like, everything she wants. And say, oh, he is, he is adorable. Um, right. What hair did he, he had like some sort of, he had very short hair, I think. I can't remember, he had a hat on. Um, I love this hair. This hair, this boy hair is really good. Ooh, he looks a bit weird from the side. Looks, he looks like he's squinting quite a lot. He looks a bit tired. Um, this hair is really cool. Ooh, I like that hair. I think that, was that Bernie's hair? That might have been Bernie's hair. Um, that, we can still reuse it. Ooh. Like, I like it. Maybe something a bit cur- Oh, oh, got a surfer chic. Right, I'm enjoying this. We'll go back to Tabitha. Hopefully something like- Oh, the, the purple looked really good on her. That's all purpley pink. So we might stick with that same colour scheme. Um, mm, maybe not. I really liked her overalls. Can we go for something, something like that? I want something stylish. I feel like she's a very stylish girl. Like Queen. She's got some of that, you know, Queen style to her. I don't know. I might play around off camera. How are we doing for time? Um, 20 minutes-ish. We have, ooh, we have plenty of time. Again, I might go for, like, a quick outfit for now, and then, like, pop in something different later. Oh, that's, oh my god, that works. And, like, she was having that moment with George, like, that really cute bonding moment, so she could really like cats. She has a cat on a t-shirt. I actually really love this. I mean, I might change it a bit so it's not as, like, you know, pre-made, preset. Is that the word? Preset? Uh, what can we do? Maybe a skirt would be kind of cute, maybe? Ooh, ooh. Very nice. Is there a jean skirt? I'm to go for, like, something denim. No, no de Oh, no. That's, like... Mm, I'm on the fence. I'm on the fence. I'm a bit hesitant. That's not too bad. Oh, oh, yes, I like... I like, oh, if we get some sort of, like, black bracelet to maybe, you know, tie the look together. Oh, very nice. Very nice. Necklace, maybe. Accessorize. Accessories are key. <gasps> oh, we stand. Oh, my God, that is cute. That is adorable. I like it. I'm feeling it. I'm feeling it right. Back to Brock. Our main man, Brock. Can we get his hat back, like his little flat, what's it called, flat caps? Flat, what are they, I don't know what they're called, snapbacks. Who knows? Uh, caps. Is there one for kids? I can't see one. Oh, come on, I want a flat one. I guess we could go with one of these. Which one? Which one did Perry have? I don't want him to have the same one that, no, not Perry, sorry. What's her face? Bernie. Forgot Bernie's name. Meant to say Bernie. Uh, I'm kind of feeling that one, not going to lie. I wish we could have a flat one. That would be really cool, but today is not the day, I guess. Orion had that one, so I don't want to give him the same one as Orion. I think Bernie had this one, so we could always go for this one. I don't know. I don't want to have, like, a Bernie 2.0, because he's going to be quite jockey as well. So I want him to have, like, a bit of a different style. I liked his sort of blue and orange thing that was going on. If we could, like, maybe translate that. Um, ooh, what should we do? <laughs> That's hella cool. I'm feel. Oh, flannel. <gasps> yes. 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 We're oh. Oh, now we're talking. Sorry, sometimes the style looks are, like, actually really good. And they're, like, they're great inspiration. If you don't know what to do. Oh. Oh, maybe we could go for one of these, like, little army hats. <gasps> he looks like the McCready from Fallout 4. It's like a little baby McCready. Oh, my God. Wait, no, we see baby McCready in Fallout 3. Ignore my statement. Um, but how adorable is he? Maybe, like, can we give him, like, some glasses, some sunglasses? He's feeling a bit cool. <gasps> I'm trying to think. Do we have any kids who actually wear glasses? I'm not sure if we do. Junko wears glasses. Um, Wisteria with glasses. I think that's literally it. Oh my god, maybe we should give him some glasses. We need more glasses, kids. Oh, Alex has glasses. 
a bit of a pattern is emerging here. All the smart kids ones, all the smart ones have glasses. Way to um stereotype. Ooh, maybe some aviators. <gasps> oh, what a cool dude. I think maybe that's a bit overkill. We'll just stick with this for now. Maybe some earrings. Oh, yes. Right. Amazing. We have two adorable new kids uh, added to the family. Beautiful. Maybe a little bit of a watch. Can we not put a watch on? Okay, we can't give him a watch then. That's fine. No watch for him. He'll never know what the time is. That's fine. Right. Should I end the episode? Is now the time to end the episode? I can't think of anything else to do. I mean, it's practically bedtime for all of them. Mmm. What should we do? What do? We're like 25 minutes in. Maybe it's best to end the episode. Ooh. This happens like every episode. I'm always like, should I end it? Should I not end it? And I just end up wasting time debating about whether or not I should end it and ultimately do nothing of value except talk about whether or not I should end the episode. I, I can keep going, I think, for maybe a couple minutes. John Bowman. Oh. Love him. Phoenix Fish. We haven't seen her in a while. Phoenix Fish. Go say hi. Go give her a hug. Should we give her a key to our house? <gasps> I mean, I feel bad because we did sleep with her husband. Like, quite a lot. Invite to feel... Oh. I thought I said, like, feel her baby. Then I was like, whoa, we got a new fish? Ooh, actually, we need to go see a uh, Mercury fish. I promised that we would go and visit Mercury fish. we got to go see how Mercury is doing. It's been a while. I, I did try and see her the other episode, but, like, she wasn't in because it was, like, a school day. Brad's got a hat on. Should we introduce Brad to her? They're both kind of weird, so they might possibly maybe hit it off. We could... <gasps> Wait, hold on. Will that, will that ruin the family tree? I'm trying to think. Because she is, like, a half sib. No, she's a... No, she is a step-sibling. No, she's a half-sibling. Sorry, this is confusing me. Um, Here she is. She's doing fine. I love her little, like, UFO shirt. Oh, she, oh she's, mm, she's a little bit creepy. Um, Besties. What's Besties' friendly introduction? I mean, let's go give that a go. I'm trying to think. Hold on, let me just see. So, she is the half-sister, I think, is the correct term to the fishes that we know yes so if she marries brad it doesn't really make it incest because they're not blood related because brad because they brad is a half sister no brad is a half sibling to the fishes and if they're the fishes half sibling mercury then that kind of makes them like a quarter sibling to brad or just like takes away the half into being nothing um, so I think, I think that's acceptable. Samba. Maybe next episode we'll play as Brad and just try and, like, set him up. Oh, her little alien voice. Oh. I mean, we can romance her, but then she is... Oh, is... It's, right, it's not incest if Minnie sleeps with her, surely. Like, I'm trying to think... It won't mess up the family tree. For... Actually, no, it kind of will because... Because, oh, I'm trying to think now, because then, if we had a kid with her, hypothetically, then that would be the, the, the our fish's niece and nephew, but like, a, I guess maybe like a half-niece nephew, but then, oh my god, this is hurting my brain. We're not even going to, right, why are we even discussing this? Because we are hell, we're like so not sleeping with her in the first place, so why even bother juggle this hypothetical? I want to set... Why is Brad taking a picture of us? I want to set up, like, Brad and what's the face if we can do that. How can we do that? We can't, like... We can't do that, can we? Like, as a third party. We ha we'd have to take control of Brad to do that, I guess. Which I might do off camera. Who knows? Hey. Ah. What is she a teen as well, actually? She's no, she's an adult, because we could flirt oh, with her. And so is Brad. Brad is actually very young, compared to, like, Mini Junior. In a bay. Anyway, um. Oh my god, we're so close with her! I guess that was the besties interaction. Uh, we'll sign an autograph and end the episode if we can do that. Whoa, is she not a fan? She's not a fan. Um. Right, let's end the episode. Yes, end the episode. Right, if you enjoyed today's episode of the 100 Baby Challenge, please feel free to like, comment, and subscribe. Twitter link down below. Feel free to follow it or not. It is up to you, and I will see you guys in the next 
video. Hey YouTube, I just want to give a big thanks to everybody who's been watching this series so far and giving like all your support and all your love to it. I love reading all your comments. Here we are, episode 50, which I can't even fathom. Like, I remember filming the very first episode, 49 episodes ago. So yeah, thanks to everyone who's been watching, who's been loving, and who's been enjoying the series. Thank you so much. Um, you make my day, truly. Here's to the next 50.